the reason why photography is important to me is because um, I think it's a reminder uh, that to a certain extent, life is about your perspective. When I grew up, I was homeschooled. I was like, I grew up kind of, uh, kind of like scared of people. And so photography was a great way to like be around people because I wanted to learn more about people, but I also was sort of frightened of them and didn't want to talk to them. So photojournalism is pretty much like all of the things that I did not want to do with photography. I don't know if I would say that I've always been this methodical um, packing my bag. I've always been, the cleaning part of it is something that I've just always done. I, you know, I would clean it, uh, clean front and rear elements of uh, pretty much all of my lenses before I leave. And then also when I get back, because um, I feel like it's just a dust blower, why not? Like, what's the harm? Um, you know, clean the sensor. Um, but I guess it also, it's kind of like, I really enjoy using the tools that I have and um, you gotta take care of your tools. Uh, as far as double checking the equipment that's actually in the bag, that's something that I actually started doing after um, uh, after I worked as a flight attendant is because one of the things that you can't do is if you accidentally leave something on a plane um, and the plane like if you're sw if you're switching planes and you got to you know work a different one you know you can't get it back so like you know check check double check um, so I just started double checking you know to make sure that I had all the belongings that I needed um, off the plane when I got off and I guess I just started you know doing that with my photography equipment as well Photojournalism is a reminder to stay curious about the world that you live in. And it's, I would, I would be lying if I didn't say that part of it is because I just like to um, play around with trying to make, uh, with trying to make pretty pictures. That's definitely a part of it. Um, but the other part of it is that, you know, if I get good at this and I can start doing work that's actually going to benefit people, um, then there is a positive result for my wanting to just talk to people um, and make pretty pictures. And so if I can do both of those things um, in some kind of field where there's a potential positive benefit from just doing what I like to do, um, that's kind of like a no-brainer. Like, who would not want to do that?